And across five country, many cities are hosting their own eclipse celebrations. The city of Boonville is one of them, throwing a multi-day festival. Today was day two of three straight days of the event, and 5 News reporter Parker Abels went down there to see how they're celebrating. On Monday, just before 2 p.m., the city of Boonville and other parts of the state will go completely dark. And city leaders are so excited, they decided to throw a three-day-long party. But while this festival is only three days, it's been on city council member Stacy Holbert's mind for much longer. Two years ago, I was watching a webinar by the Arkansas Tourism Department who talked about how we were going to have this big event, the eclipse in Arkansas, and it was going to be a huge tourist opportunity. So I started gathering people in our town who might like to create an eclipse festival to take advantage of that tourism opportunity. And since then, Holbert has been working tirelessly, making sure the events are ready to go. And tomorrow, the eclipse day, we're going to have music again, but we're having a vendor fair. We have a petting zoo. We have activities for the kids. We have food trucks and then we're going to watch the eclipse. This is a beautiful area and we wanted to bring people here and show this off. On top of that, the local businesses and student athletes around town are also benefiting from the eclipse and festival. It's been amazing for us um, on the Mercantile and Main Shops and uh, we have several vendors who have made special shirts and keychains and hats for the event. Our school is pretty small and we don't have like a whole bunch of money in our funding but raising this money for it will get us the money to go to the camp and the tournaments this summer. In Boonville, covering news where you live, Parker Abels, 5 News. The total eclipse will last for 3 minutes and 27 seconds in Boonville from 149 to a little after 152 p.m.